Hello friends, welcome back. We are going to have a new playlist where we will have top 30 interview questions from Linux handled. We will have 10 questions for each session and we will have three sessions totally. All of them are asked frequently in the interviews and it is expected that you know this fundamentals in any interview that you go. Let's go to the uh, questions right away and it's all very easy at the same time very important to know. Can you go to the first question? What is the difference between the Linux and Unix? Unix is a proprietary operating system from Bell Laboratories and it is to be paid for you to use it. I mean you need to purchase it but Linux is a open source free non-proprietary OS which means it can be used by anyone without any fee. The best example is the Ubuntu. You can download Ubuntu and you can use it just like that without paying any fee. Linux was developed by Linus Torvalds and remember that point. What is the expansion of Unix? Unix is not UNIX actually, it is UNICS. People call it Uniplexed Information and Computing System or Computing Service. And remember, this is one of the best operating systems available in the market. This is really used in most crucial and critical applications in the market. Define shell, what is bash? Shell is where you and me type all the commands and most importantly, this is a command interpreter. What do you mean by command interpreter, sir? Very simple, you type the command, say for example, ls, date, all these commands are being typed somewhere, right? That is the place where we call it as shell. The place where you type your commands and you get the reply back is called a shell. Remember, all the commands are being typed in the shell and shell is nothing but a program which can execute other programs. The most commonly used uh, shell is bash which is called bone again shell. This was built by Steve Bone and this is the replacement of the original bone shell and this is most frequently and commonly used in the market. And this comes by default with most of the versions of Linux. Mention the names of the shells that you are aware of. Bash shell, which is nothing but the bone again shell. C shell, which is uh, the most frequently used next to bash. TCSH shell, which is nothing but the enhanced and improved C shell. K shell, which is called the con shell. And fish, fish is nothing but friendly and interactive shell. The next one is nothing but a Lilo. What is Lilo? Lilo is nothing but the Linux loader. It is the bootloader that is used for Linux, used by Linux that enables Linux uh, that, that enables Linux to be loaded to the memory. Whenever you have memory, that memory has to be loaded with Linux and this Lilo take, takes care of it. It is the earliest of the bootloaders available in the market but now it is replaced by Grub. Grub is the uh, latest of the uh, bootloader that is available in place of Lilo and it does the work of Lilo. So remember, Lilo is nothing but Linux loader. So this is one of the very important questions asked in the interview. Do not forget it. The next question is, what are the major components of Linux OS? Hardware, kernel, shell, utilities. Hardware, all the peripherals, take the RAM, hardware, CPU, whatever you have in front of you, hard drive, they are all hardware. They contribute a very important component in Linux. Kernel, kernel is nothing but heart and core of the Linux. People call it Linux kernel actually. So it is responsible for all the activities that the Linux does. There are two types of kernels available, monolithic and micro kernel. Shell, shell is nothing but the command interpreter. And remember, this is the place where you type all your commands and you get your reply. Utilities, utilities are, every command can be called an utility. Even shell is an utility. Whichever utility, whichever service you use from the operating system through which you can use the complete uh, uh, features of operating system, I can call it an utility. Uh, OS functions are accessed only through the utility is the point. Remember, all these things together constitute um, Linux operating system. We'll go to the next one. What is CLI? CLI is nothing but command line interface. Through this interface only users can type commands and perform operations. What are links in Linux and what is soft link and hard link? This is one of the frequently asked questions in the interview the soft link and the hard link. A links as the name specify is nothing but a link to the file. Soft link is like the shortcut in the windows. You have a file let's say D drive, some location. You want to access it through the shortcut in the desktop. You right click it, keep a shortcut in the desktop 
and that's called soft link in Linux. We have a command to do it and the command is ln hyphen s. Hard link. Hard link is nothing but creating a copy of the file. I have a file, I create another copy of the file, even if the source is deleted, destination will remain. So we have command for it again, ln source file name, destination file name. Soft links won't work if the source file is deleted. Hard link will work even if the source file is deleted because they are two different files. What is the impact of control alt delete in Linux? Simple, the machine will be restarted immediately. Not like Windows, it will take time, it will be instant. How are the hidden files identified? Most of the configuration files are hidden files and they are proceeding with a dot. Dot Shriram says that Shriram is a hidden file and you cannot see it with a normal listing. You need to use ls-a. ls-a will list you all the hidden files. We will have the next session shortly where we will see rest of the 10 questions which are very important to crack the Linux interview. Thank you.